Uh, but ladies, ladies have a lot of freedom and privileges, right? You, you see, I've noticed a lot of uh, protests. You know, when people are not happy about what is happening in the country, the price of fuel, I don't know, the government, whatever. Some people get so angry that they take off their clothes. You know what I mean? Like, they go to a main road, Parliament Avenue, in front of police, and they're like, ah, we are tired, we are tired, the price of fuel. I've noticed it's only women who can do that. <laughs> you remember Stella Nyans? She wasn't happy with, uh, I don't know, they had closed her office, you know, she lost her job. She went out, you know, Makere University, took off everything. I don't remember what I saw. <laughs> it's like, I'm tired, I need my office. What do you do? What do you do? The next day, her office was returned to her. Even in Arua, their ladies, I think their land was being taken by some rich guy. They did the same. Their land was given back to them. And this is the, the theory I have. I think women can get away with these things because, first of all, there's that tag of mother. Our mothers. <laughs> when a woman takes off her clothes and she's there, it's like, Woo, we are tired. The price of fuel. How can shop be 10,000? We are tired. I am not happy. People are like, hey, our mothers. What is wrong with our mother? They feel sympathy for her. And also, another advantage is that when women are doing their thing, here, everything moves accordingly. Things here move together. <laughs> and when a woman is doing her thing, people focus at the center of the issue. What is she talking about? What is she talking about? But men, let me tell you, my brother, you go out with this prize of fuel. You go to Parliament Avenue with all the anger in your heart. All the anger, you're like, I'm tired of fuel. I, I'm, everyone is walking. How? How? And you also take off your shirt. We are tired. Oh, oh, this government is doing nothing for us. Tanzania reduced the taxes, but here they are doing nothing. You remove the jacket. You throw it. Continue. Hey, first of all, this is the beauty about Ugandans. They have time. <laughs> they will gather. Because <laughs> you see, I've learned this about Ugandans. Ugandans look busy. When you're walking on the streets, eh, everyone looks like he has purpose. Like he has... You see somebody in a briefcase, in a suit. You see him and... You think to yourself, this must be going for an interview, a job interview or something. They look like, he looks like a lecturer. He has a lesson, he's about, you know. But when something stupid is happening, <laughs> you'll find that same guy there. Hey, hey, what is wrong? <laughs> You're like, boss, don't you have an interview? It will wait, it will wait, it will <laughs> We have time. So you see, you're going to have time. They will gather. They will gather. And the best part is the comments, right? Because when a man takes off his clothes to protest about anything, first of all, Things here don't move in motion. You go left, other things go right. <laughs> you stop, they continue. You don't know. <laughs> and when a man takes off his clothes, people focus at the center of the person. That's where they focus. You'll be very aggrieved, very annoyed. We are tired, fuel. Ah, ah, I am tired. You remove your box and you throw it. I'm tired. Fuel. How? Soap. 10,000. Will I bathe again? We are tired. Uh -huh. You'll hear an old lady in the crowd, very old woman, 75 years, just going, ee, ee. Mm, 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 mm. No, 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 no. Muhammad hasn't circumcised. How? <laughs> And it's worse, it's worse if you're a man who puts on specs, right? Like you're short-sighted or something and you have specs and you're there, the specs keep falling down. We are tired, fuel, the specs fall, you pick them. I'm tired, we cannot. This is very wrong, it falls down, we are tired. <laughs> Someone will abuse you. You'll hear an old woman, they're saying, hey, we thought it was just the eyes. <laughs> Everything is short-sighted. <laughs> Everything is short-sighted. Men, if you're long-sighted, make some noise. Some have not understood the joke. Some have not. You need visual effects. 
Uh, uh, you are Kenyan. <laughs> 